Hey guys, welcome back to Draenor with our um, Draenei Hunter uh, Goblin and Eek the Cat, as always. Um, <clears throat> so, uh, in the last episode, uh, I talked about uh, we're going to be going to probably Gorgorond and uh, continuing like the story missions. But in between that, I uh, queued up for, uh, like, I got a bunch of skinning stuff done, um, and got uh, quite a few, uh, I think I had, like, four stacks at one point, and uh, <clears throat> did some burnished leather and stuff like that. Um, but I also queued up for uh, the daily uh, quest to go into uh, Iron Docks again, and I got uh, an upgrade. Um, a, a black iron sniper rifle, which is pretty good. And I also got a new belt. Uh, and that actually brought our item level up to 543. So I'm really pleased about that. Um, I think the only thing under that is our... Yeah, just a few of these odds and ends. So, yeah, I love that ring that I got. So, <clears throat> But, yeah... Uh, I think I actually got those. I can't remember where I got those, but anyway. So what I'm going to do is uh, we're going to go on and fly up to Gorgorond. Um, <clears throat> and uh, so we don't get like an item anymore. We're just going to get bonus experience and some cash. <clears throat> so I'm actually going to queue up straight for Akendown, So <clears throat> So in the meantime, uh, we're going to go on and fly up to Akendoon. Or not Akendoon. Gorgorod, there we go. <clears throat> and I did spend um, a little bit of time um, kind of reading a little bit about what's actually going on and uh, some of the pre-release stuff. Um, I mean, I didn't get a chance to read a lot of that because I was working so much. Uh, but basically, uh, Garrosh, uh, at the end of Mist of Pandaria, like... Um, the big siege of Ogremar and all of that. Um, like after we defeated him, um, he escaped with some help of someone who could allow him to travel through time. He's traveled back in time, uh, even before the Horde uh, first invaded Azeroth. Like all of this happens before Warcraft One. So. Um, like, he prevented them from being corrupted by the uh, Burning Legion, which I'm not for sure how the Burning Legion are going to handle that, because, uh, yeah, they're going to be pretty pissed, I would think. <clears throat> um, and it, it, it kind of, like, um, like the Twilight Council, like, that's kind of what their deal was. You know, they were... Uh, you know, kind of working with the Burning Legion, so I'm, I'm curious as to how he's kind of worked through all of that, and like has convinced these warlocks to uh, um, <clears throat> to work with him, so uh, well, I mean, I assume he said, you know, work with me, or I'm going to cut your hands off, or, or worse. <laughs> so, wow. So we're out of like a forested area into like a jungle, so this will this will be fun to work, to run around with. Uh, and I looked at uh, like um, I guess I sold that treasure map that I was supposed to uh, use uh, for Shadow Moon Valley because like nothing ever happened, um, which is kind of disappointing. Uh, I'm surprised that they made that even sellable at all. So, oh, Eral. Many leagues of deadly land yet stand between us and the Black Rock. No, okay. We must unite. Uh, welcome to Gorgoron, Commander. We only just arrived ourselves. We must never rest. Uh, Gorgoron is one of the most untamed landscapes in all of Draenor. Only the most skilled of the Rangari venture this deep into the wilds. It is their camp that we're heading for. If you wish to travel ahead, you can be found down this path and to the right. Broad and I shall follow after you momentarily. We still have some logistics to work out. Okay. Please be careful. We should have brought an army to fight the Iron Horde. Gorgrond is no place for armies. 
This land swallows all who enter. We will be fortunate to even lay eyes upon the Iron Horde base. No. Where do we stand? Badra Grey sends word from your garrison that they have spotted a fleet of Iron Horde at the shores of Talador. We must not allow them to destroy Shatrath. Our All enemies right. must fall. So there's uh, like two Shatrath cities now, uh, which is going to be like, that's going to blow my mind a little bit. So. Uh, oh, we've already got a bonus mission. All right. So we're just going to jump straight into that. Whoa, holy cow. Wow, that guy's like wrecking stuff. Uh, he does not like dwarven stuff, apparently. These are all elites. That spell is ready. Yeah. I can't cast that. That's still retrying. I need a tarp. Keeping out, keeping an eye out for uh, rare spawns and lootables. Yeah. So now we're uh, our item level is high enough. Uh, we don't, you know, we're uh, tearing through stuff pretty quick. Um, I still like the. Uh, Spec and stuff, so <clears throat> hmm. well, I never noticed that. Like I the uh, the bullets. Oh, there. Critters. Oh, yeah, we don't have a lumber mill yet, so. <clears throat> yeah, I know, I probably should have done uh, the Telrador area first uh, before coming up here, just. Uh, so that we could upgrade the, um, um, uh, the garrison again, but, but I did get my first, uh, level 100, um, follower, um, so, and I've got a couple of 99s, so, uh, like their item level is actually higher than mine, which is, I find hilarious, but, uh, I guess that's kind of how it's, uh, how it's supposed to go. Uh, I know once we get, um, yeah. once we get uh, into, uh, or a uh, level two garrison, uh, we're supposed to be able to, uh, uh, to be able to uh, take some of those with us, you know, like out in missions. So that'll be interesting. I would be kind of curious as to uh, like which one uh, uh, that I would I would decide to take with me, you know, like maybe a healer or a, a pocket tank or something like that.
Is that an elite or a rare? Oh no, he's an elite. We're not gonna mess with him. <clears throat> so no skinnables yet. Uh, just kinda, you know. <clears throat> I'm not like overly working on my uh, uh, leather working. Uh, oh yeah, that's I love those those little side missions like that. Uh, I'm not overly working on my uh, leather working. Um, <clears throat> just because, you know, I just want to, um, harden thorn vine, what's that? You need to be in a shredder to chop that up. Okay. This doesn't look good. right past the cave. Okay. What do we have here? A hero? Gorgon is no place for heroes, my friend. Oh. Uh, we'll have to come back to finish that. I can do... Good. We must have arrived before Terangor and Gul'dan. Naomi is working to bolster the defenses against their assault. Follow me. We will report to her. So no, uh, I'm assuming there's like quests to kind of send us in here. Uh, we've kind of semi been sent in. Isn't it? So. Just it. You're one of the first outsiders to see inside Akindu. Yeah, in uh. In BC, oh, well, I guess we went the wrong way. In, uh, in BC, like, all of this is just, like, a big husk in, uh, the middle of the, the dead waste, so. Or the bone waste, I should say. <clears throat> because, uh, Let us uh it got blew up. The Vindicators and the Egg Talks of the past. Ooh, Heroes mate. all, their souls still remain with us. Naomi, we are here. What is this? Oh no. No! Uh oh. Yes, Tulan. Now you see. Your efforts were valiant. I did not think the Anchorites could power the defenses with only one of the crystals. But nothing will stop my plan, nor that of my mess. And the only thing is in our way. You have to stop them! Are you, Tulani, and your outsider friends? Uh-oh. Oh! oh. <laughs> Make sure my uh, aspect of the pack is turned off. That ability is red. I need to target something first. I need a target. Yeah, I need to, uh, I need to target something first. Find a, uh, A 
combat dummy and uh, work on my, uh, oh goodness, uh, work on my uh, uh, rotation a little. And I also need to uh, reinstall like my DPS meters and all of that, especially since I'm uh, going to be grouping up and uh, eventually doing like some raids and stuff. So. It is done. As for you, oh, I no. it is that one of my tools dispatches the others. Protect her! Destroy these intruders! None live who assaults the holy Hawkenheim. Oh. I will strike you down! The protector still answers her call. You will have to defeat it. I can't do that yet. Not ready yet. That ability isn't ready. I don't know if those uh, things actually that. hurt, but uh, we're going to go in and assume that they do. Bathe in the glory of the light. Not ready yet. Can't interrupt that. I can't do that yet. That ability isn't ready. Oh. Not ready yet. That I was supposed to hide behind ready. that shield that uh, I moved out from behind. Lovely. I can't do that. There we go. <laughs> Not my best, uh... Go the way. The defenses. Uh, 570. Okay. She had help. Her order were corrupt. I will gather any who remain loyal here and protect them. You, please, go put a stop to this madness. I gotta figure out how to do my rotation so my focus stays up higher. Definitely lagging behind in my ability here. Not ready yet. I'm wondering if maybe I need to switch my spec up a little bit, maybe. <clears throat> I mean, um, I know back in, uh, oh, get out of there. That ability isn't ready. Uh, some of my earlier videos, I was uh, Beast Master, and uh, I think the, the DPS is Not less spiky. Yet. That makes sense. And, um, <clears throat> like, it's more uh, readily accessible, I guess. Because a lot of times I'm just standing here, like, aimed shotting, you know, like I'm casting. Uh, and I'm, uh, maybe uh, I need to work on uh, getting some more uh, haste kind of thing. I don't know. That ability isn't ready yet. 